Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Rini and this is of course the Enchanted Planner. Uh, today we is going to unbox some goodies. Which one do I want to start with first? I think we'll start with the washi. Um, I placed an order from the washi tape shop and got some of the washi that I have been coveting for quite a while but I was very excited. Decided to plunge on in and get the washi. So let's get the stuff out of the box and then I will share with you the fun goodies I bought. What's this? Dear customer, we want to personally thank you for your order with us. It's so nice. It's so nice. This is really pretty. Um, Lunar New Year is coming up actually. Now that I think about it, uh, it's February 1st. All right, so first up on the agenda, let me get a piece of paper for swatching. I have another one around here somewhere that I had swatched washi on recently, but I can't find it. But if you saw the state of my bloody office right now, you'd be shaking your head going, girl, get on that, because oh my God. So my intention today is to film the three videos I need to film because I had a photo shoot yesterday, which was very fabulous. I can't wait to share um, some stuff with you guys on that when I get images back. But um, it was needless to say Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday were kind of taken up with prepping for the photo shoot because it's a photo shoot for my web shop, or my, my web shop, my web shop, no, my website um, relaunch. Oh my God. You know, you know, I had to get the kitty cats. You just know I had to get the kitty cats. So let's see if we can gently peel this off without damaging anything. Awesome. I don't know that I can guarantee about the same at the bottom and the top though. Uh, yeah, I tend to be one of those people that carefully unwraps their Christmas presents too. <laughs> so there's a little bit of insider information into my personality. I also tend to be one of those people that goes a little bit tape crazy when I am wrapping my gifts. And as my daughter will probably be watching this video at some point, she's probably shaking her head. Although she inherited that trait, I will say, I don't want to rip you. Will you come up? Will you come up? Because that damn cat is way too cute. And I may actually share some of these with my daughter because they're so cute. Okay, let's bust into this baby. It is, what day is it today? It's Thursday. Um, you guys watched my um, interesting vertical video this morning. Oh my God, I, I, you should have seen the first one. That was just, oh my Lord. <laughs> okay, we have four pretty rolls of washi. And some really nice paper. Really nice paper. Okay, what's up first? What have I got? Pick, pick, pick. Oh my god, these are so cute. Okay, now, where is the... I see something here. What is this? Um, come on. I just want to get you off. Come on. <laughs> okay, it's not cooperating with me, guys. I don't know why it's being so difficult. And I don't really want to rip the washi tape. So they package it really pretty, and then they put this intense, crazy, like, washi tape on here that doesn't want to come off. And I'm ripping that sticker, and I don't want to rip that sticker. Because these ones, okay, I'm just going to pull it off like that, and then we can fight this. Um, these ones are washi tape stickers. And if you've watched Desiree's videos, you probably have seen these. But these are new to me, so you're suffering through. <laughs> Oh my god, these are so cute. Look at how cute these are. The kitty cat with the wine, and the kitty cat with the butterflies, and the kitty cat scratching the furniture. How much have we got? Oh, there's a lot of them. Okay, hold on here. How do we come off? How stinking adorable are these? And you know these are ending up in a spread really soon. Oh my dear, these are so cute. So cute. Okay, so now are you going to come off? Probably not. So instead of fighting with you, I can't remember if Desiree said, see, they should have made the flowers washi tape stickers too. I will probably do that. Okay, these are so adorable. They are very delicate though, I will tell you that much because they are washi tape. Those are so stinking cute. Okay. I don't want to go too crazy with this because I'm sure y'all have seen them. 
but they're damn cute. Okay. Oh, we don't want to open that one yet. We have this one. Oh, I have to fight this again. Okay, let's do it. Because this is like intense, man. Okay. All right. But I'm taking up sticker. I'm going to have to email them and say the packaging on this was not the brightest. All right. Well, I don't know what to do here because it's ripping one of my stickers and it's very annoying. Okay. Let's take a look. Oh my God. They're just so cute. See, there's the kitty cat in the box. Because, you know, cats in boxes. If you've ever had a cat, there is no box too small for them to fit into. Funny story, we had a 25 pound tabby at one point. He's no longer with us, cutie. Um, he died, <laughs> well, old age. I mean, the guy was getting old, man. I think he was like 20. But Tiger, as he was called, was huge. My daughter used to say he wasn't fat, he was big boned. And the cat had paws, like... He was a big cat. Yes, he was overweight. He was 25 pounds, but he was also a big cat. Like this cat was a big boy. Well, we had several boxes that were like, you know, regular shoe boxes. And I've got a picture of it somewhere in the stash because, oh, look at that. It's like, what movie is that? <sighs> Fox and the Hound. No, not in Fox and the Hound. Lady and the Tramp. But with cats. Um, yeah, so he squished himself into this box. And all his chub is hanging over the edge. <laughs> oh, it's stuck down with a washi tape. So it's, you know, there. like I said, there is no box too small that cats will not try and get themselves into. Okay, we won't be taking that sticker off, apparently, and I'm not going to fight with it while I'm on camera making you guys, you know, watch the struggle is real. Oh my god, these are so cute. Okay, so that is Rashi tape roll number three. And number four is, I think, just a regular roll of washi tape. Come on, washi tape shop. Like, it's great that you guys are like branding, but it's a bit of a pain. Oh, it's got paper on the back. I see. Okay. These are a bit of a pain in the butt, but it's doable. It's really pretty. It's like little flowers and butterflies. This has got spring written all over it. Okay. So that would be that roll. What is in here? I don't remember what is in here. Let's have a look. Oh yeah. Right. This is the cloud washi. I thought this was like really cool. It's like clouds, and I thought it could be doubled as water. And there's actually a fairly good amount on this roll. Sometimes with the ones from the washi tape shop, there's not much on the roll. But this doesn't want to rip, so let's just trim that off. But see how pretty that is? It's got little tiny birds in the background, like little seagulls. But I figured it's great for clouds, but it will also probably double well as water because unless you're on top of it, you can't see the birds. Okay, that would be that one. Now, this is the script washi that I have been dying to get my hands on for months and months. If I can get into the thing. Apparently I am challenged today. Now, is this regular washi or is this, oh, it is regular washi, I think. Yeah, I've been dying to get my hands on a roll of this for a while. Like I said, most of these have been on my list for quite a bit. And it's not like we all haven't seen the script washi, but, you know, thanks for humoring me. Because, you know, it's new to me, people. It's new to me. Oh, and this one. Because I already have a piece of pretty <clears throat> wrapping paper. I will stay with, I will, uh, don't mind ripping that one. Now I think this is on a backing. If I remember right from watching 
Tessere's video, but as y'all know, I absolutely adore dragonflies. I consider them like a totem of mine because they're never usually too far from where I am. Yeah, it does have backing on the back of it. So there's a few more rolls of washi tape I really wanted to get my hands on, but I'm like, I got to kind of like, you know, reel it in here a bit. <laughs> okay, so that doesn't want to work. So let's just trim that off. Uh, again, these are a bit of a pain to get off backings. Hold on. Okay. We have, I'll put it on the back. It's very hard to see on the white paper, but isn't that pretty? So pretty. Okay. So that concludes my purchase from the washi tape shop. Now let's move into purchase number two. Apparently the post beat up because the box is sort of open and this is the Stargazer Happy Box, which I am super excited about. And it's funny because I'm not really a big person for the Stargazer line, like the, the sticker books and stuff. I do like them, don't get me wrong, but I was excited about a few things in this box. Okay, let's find the best way to open this up. I guess because they were sending it internationally, they decided to tape this baby closed and put it in a put it in a wrapper okay so in we go <gasps> look at that lid visions of cutting that out and putting it in a frame on the wall oh that was easy okay look at that yeah i got these beautiful little affirmation cards and i know everybody's pretty much seen me so i won't worry too much about going through too much but the little what's inside box and the shimmering eyes and then the uh, insert paper which is very exciting I was looking forward to having this inside my planner and I already know what the phases of the moon are <laughs> but it's a very cool thing to be able to just you know have it inside my planner so now oh, it's all scratched what the hell happy planner like I'm not impressed with that I'll be phoning, I'll be emailing them to bitch about that. Pay this much freaking money for something. I do not want it in pieces. The moon discs are cool. I wish they were um, metal. The rose or the rose quartz is pretty in a little heart. I have one of these actually. I have a lavender, I have an amethyst one too. And then we've got this. I think this one has metal discs on it. I just think they're moon. But that's okay. Because I have the purple discs from the Stargazer. Yeah, they're mini. That's cute. But I have these. Which different, a little bit different. But they will look smashing. This may become my new turtle, uh, tarot journal. Ooh, so pretty. Okay, but I did want to get a look into the sticker book. So let's just move some stuff around on my desk here. And I know everybody's seen it, but I want to see it. So humor me. Uh, I can't say I'm really over the moon with this, but I'll probably use it. Sure, why not? Hollow. Hollow. More hollow. Oh my god, there's more hollow. <laughs> These would probably look really cool on a blackout spread. This is pretty. Look. <laughs> I just wish they weren't wild, but they are pretty. But I still was really looking forward to this book. And, well, the whole box, most of it. And I love big decor. Y'all know that. Like, whew, big decor. Love it. And we've got some little, like, smaller quotes and stuff and affirmations. I think the affirmations in here are the same as the ones that are on the cards, if I remember correctly from watching some of the flip throughs. And we got pink and purple. And then this nice blue that is not foiled, which is nice. And then black. You are enough. These are pretty. Weekly intention. Nice. It's a nice. So yeah, that's it, peoples. That's it, party people. Ooh, like I said, my desk is a calamity. That's it, party people. This is all my goodies. I have more on the way, though. I ordered the um, newest Happy Box, and then I also ordered the, um, what do you call it, the sticker day stuff. So when that shows up, that'll be kind of cool, too. I don't know why they gave us this. 
it's not really relevant <laughs> but whatever <laughs> thanks so much for watching you guys if you like this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to leave me a comment and most importantly don't forget to subscribe i am ever so close and really trying to get to a thousand subscribers so if you would do me the the honor of subscribing to my channel that would be awesome i'd greatly appreciate it thanks so much we'll see you again soon ciao